The endocrine part of the pancreas is the pancreatic islets. And as mentioned in the, the previous section, there are four different cell types. One of these cell types are the alpha cells. Alpha cells secrete glucagon, which then acts on the liver to raise blood glucose. So when blood glucose is low, alpha cells secrete glucagon, blood glucose goes up. The other cell, another cell type within uh, the pancreatic islet is the beta cells. Beta cells secrete insulin. Insulin lowers blood glucose. So when blood glucose, when blood glucose is high, insulin is secreted by the beta cells and it lowers blood glucose by forcing um, the glucose into tissues. Delta cells, uh, another cell type within the pancreatic islet, uh, secretes somatostatin. This is a little bit different than the somatostatin secreted by the hypothalamus that regulates growth hormone in the anterior pituitary. This somatostatin, it's the same peptide, but it's um, secreted under different circumstances and from a different cell type. It inhibits the secretion of glucagon and insulin, and it also reduces the absorption of nutrients from the gut. The last cell type in the pancreatic, pancreatic islet is the F cells, and the F cells secrete something called pancreatic polypeptide. And this peptide inhibits the secretion of somatostatin from the delta cells and, uh, the, and also inhibits the, um, formates the creation and secretion of the digestive enzymes of the rest of the exocrine pancreas. So in summary, what part of the pancreas is the endocrine? And what are the four hormones made by the endocrine portion of the pancreas? And then what are their actions? Once you uh, have a grip on this, you're ready for the assessment.